Hey there, it's me Roshni. It's 30th of June, which means that we are halfway into 2024. Crazy, like it's already been six months. Anyways, how is 2024 treating you? Is it treating you well or not? Let me know in the comments. I would love to know. Personally, it has not been that kind to me. But uh, there, there were a few good moments like I got to travel Himachal Pradesh, I went to Manali, I vlogged it, please go on my channel and watch those videos. I actually put in a lot of work. As I mentioned, we are going to enter a new quarter. If you don't know what a quarter is, then probably you are too young or you are not a corporate slave like me. So basically, I'm going to plan the next three months. Let's get started. For the first step, I will use the wheel of life. I got introduced to this concept through a video by Jessica La. Basically, there is this website where you can assess the different areas of your life. It is divided in like seven areas. For example, money, career, love, family, etc. You can even skip the areas which are not relevant to you. So you have to assign a score to every area and that website will generate a graphical image and you can use it as a starting point to review and reflect on each area which you think is lacking. I will leave the link in my description. So after you have done this exercise, you go ahead with reviewing each and every area and reflecting on it like in the past six months, what all happened in that area, what went wrong, what worked for you etc i have created this template with prompts that can assist you with this exercise and i will leave that link also in the description after you are done with that exercise choose a minimum of three areas which you want to focus on for the next three months for me i have picked three areas which are well career and fun for goal setting, I'll be using Tiny Changes Quarterly Day Journal, which looks like this. I picked this up as it is very comprehensive and the cover reminds me of the Claw book from the anime series Card Captor Sakura. So if you didn't already know that I'm a huge fan of CCS, it is very evident from this video. So do check that out. This journal is perfect for quarterly planning as it only has three months. The first section is writing your goals for the quarter and it has sections like for health, wealth, happiness. You can even skip out wheel of life exercise but I would still recommend you to do that. Then there is also a section for your ideal week you can plan out on what times you want to do a certain task then there is ideal day plan and night plan and work plan it also has this section where you can assess different areas of your life in a lot more detail but i think it's a bit of a stretch so i won't be doing that and then you go to monthly planning and here you write your three goals here and i think it's it is so comprehensive like you plan out the entire month and there are so many pages for monthly planning as well there is budget expenses also but i won't be doing that i do it digitally then we go to daily planning this planner has like two pages for each day this is supposed to be done in the morning and this is supposed to be done before you go to bed and basically you are reflecting upon your day so this was my quarterly plan and also monthly plan for july if you like this video then you will like 
this video as well. So do check it out.